we have some famous book characters here to challenge some of our students on reading fluency. Would you like to meet our famous judges today? The moon can look different, it can look orange, white, and red. I see an orange moon at night. What is under the orange moon? Oh, Papa Bear, that was very quick. Good job, Papa Bear. Let's see how Mustafa reads that. Mustafa, scoot on up here. All right, boys and girls, here we go. What is under the... What is under the orange moon? These trees are under it. These leaves are under it. These yummy apples are under it. This brown fox is under it. This sweat owl is under it. I like to see the orange moon. Wow! Very good job, Mustafa! All right, Papa Bear, Mustafa, come over here. Judges, let's see, boys and girls. If you think Papa Bear did a better job, give me a point. If you think Mustafa Bear did a better job, give me a two. Okay, let's see if the judges agree with you. Here we go. Man in the yellow suit? 
Good things to do. Many things are good to do. Eating vegetable vegetables is good to do. Vegetables help you stay well. Reading books is good for you. Books help you do well in sc school. Playing is very good for you. It can keep you from getting sick. Washing your hands is good to do too. It also helps to keep you well. Sleeping is good for you. It helps your body rest. It is good to stay well. It is no fun to be sick. So do these things and stay well. Good job, Froggy! Yeah. All right, Adam, are you ready to challenge Froggy? Good things to do. Many things are good to do. Eating vegetables is good to do. Vegetables help you stay well. Reading books is good for you. Books help you do well in school. Playing is very good for you. It can keep you from getting sick. Wash your hands. <coughs> it is good to do. It also helps to keep you well. Sleeping is good for you. It helps your body rest. It is good to stay well. It is no fun to be sick, so do these things and stay well. Wow, nice job! Kim said to her brother Mike. She went to answer the door. Look at this, she said. Tom and P Patter here. Do you want to play outside with us? Asked Pat. It is a good day to play outside. Come on, said Tom. We want to play a ge game of tag in the park. It will be lots of fun. Yes, I want to play tag with you, said Kim. Kim might come al along too. He is great at playing tag. Sure, let's go. We will all play tag, said Tom. Oh, good job, Arthur. Read the title first. Go ahead. Let's play tag. I wonder who's ringing the doorbell, Kim said to her brother, Mike. She went to answer the door. Look at this, she said. Tom and Pat are here. Do you want to play with us? asked Pat. It is a good day to play outside. Come on, said Tom. We want to play a game of tag in the park. It will be lots of fun. Yes, I want to play with you, said Kim. Can Mike come along too? He is great at playing tag. Sure, let's go. We will play tag. We will all play tag, said Tom. Nice job, Mishra. Good work. All right, second grade graders, come on over. Let's see how they did. One of you think Arthur, two of you think Mishra. All right, let's see. Judges, man in a yellow suit, Arthur. Pinkalicious, Mishra. And Cody. Yes, I would. <laughs> Try 
trees come in many different ships, shapes and sizes. Trees can be small or large. Some trees can grow as tall as a 30, 39 story building. Um, um, others may be shorter than a one story building. Pine trees grow in areas where the weather is cool. They are shaped like cones. P pine trees often are found in mm, mountains. Nice job, Superman! Start right where he left off. Palm trees grow in areas where the weather is warm. They look like poles with a bunch of leaves at, top, at the top and often are found on beaches. Some trees have wide leaves while other trees have narrow leaves. Oak trees have bumpy leaves and elm trees have pointy leaves. Trees can be different, can be as different as people. Wild things in the park. Are you a nature lover? Spring and summer are perfect seasons to sign up for a city park nature walk. Pack up a hand lens and a camera. You might want to take along a notebook too. I think that was too slow. The nature tour leader speaks to your group. Don't chase the wild things, let them come to you. You jot down what she says along with several new facts. Nice job, Miss Frizzle. Give her a hand. All right, Johan. As you walk, walk along the dirt path that went through the park to the lead. Wild things in the park. Are you a nature lover? Spring and summer are perfect seasons to sign up for a city park nature walk. Pack up a hand lens and a camera. You might want to take along a notebook too. The nature tour leader speaks to your group. Don't chase the wild things. Let them come to you. You jot down what she says along with several new facts. As you walk along the dirt path that winds through the park, the leader points out many of the park's occupants. Look, it's a robin, the first sign of spring. You notice an endangered falcon resting in the treetops, and you snap a picture. Bees buzz around wildflowers in full bloom. A lizard basks on a large rock. There are all sorts of interesting plants, but don't touch that one. It has three leaves. Suddenly you remember something you wrote down earlier. Leaves of three, let them be. Oh no, poison ivy, that's one wild thing you don't want to encounter. Nice job, yeah! Woo! Good job! Come on up here! Alright, judges, audience, one for Miss Fizzle, two for Hannah. Let's see what we got. Alright, let's see what our judges have to say. Judgment in the yellow suit, Hannah. Pink Delicious, Hannah. And Cody.
the dance. Come on, let's see what you got here, right. right here. <laughs> Come to me, huh?